All right, let's. Oh no! 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 Oh boy, we just got ourselves a whole three-minute break, everyone. Matter of fact, I'm just gonna sleep on the ground real quick. Good as new. Anyways, we have a lot to do today. And by a lot, I mean we're just gonna loot the surrounding neighborhood and cross our fingers we don't get murdered. Horribly. But I'm actually really surprised at how we were able to survive until the second episode. Not sure how it's gonna go now. We've already got the attention of a zombie. Uh, dispatch, please. Yeah, there we go. And my, my spear broke. There's two, there's two, there's two. They're doing a pincer maneuver on me. This is not good. All right, we're just gonna hold them off. Shut that door. I actually can't believe my spear already broke. <laughs> oh man. And I'm exhausted. I, I moved like three inches. Well, we're gonna have to kill these things. Oh, they're in. Oh, 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 actually they left us a plank. Yes, this is good. We just gotta make our way over towards that plank. Solid snake style. Make that spear. We're back in business. Oh, that did not work. Oh, they're angry. You're next, lady. Come on. Well, I think we've earned a, <laughs> a solid rest now. Right on this bench here. Time to hobble our way over towards the neighbor's house. Though I am really liking this small little neighborhood here. And I am thinking of barricading this place off with some furniture and we just hunkered down in this place, you know? This is just a small thought from me to you. But that's probably gonna take a few days, so we're not in any rush. Though the helicopter event does kind of put us in that situation to start to freak out. Let's check the shed first. I'm feeling pretty confident about this. Ooh, screwdriver. Another screwdriver. Hey, hey oh, oh, that's actually awesome. Yes. All right, let's. Oh no! 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 You've got to be fucking kidding me! All right, all right, that's fine, that's fine. We're gonna hop the fence here. Wait, we dropped the gas. We dropped our only. Oh, it's gonna be fine. We just have to sit in the corner. You think it's safe on the other side? Maybe it's not that bad. I kind of. I really need that gas. I. Oh, Craig. You are the most unlucky bastard I have ever had the chance to play. And that's saying a lot. All right, well, we're not completely out of it yet. Let's just take a little peek, see on the other side. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. That's not good. That's not good at all. If, if it's just you, I'm gonna hurry up, take you in here, push you down, and we're gonna take you out in a timely, controlled manner. There we go. It doesn't help that we don't have a freaking front door either. Welcome to the party, lady. Come, come into the closet. It's a very f f grand place where you can really learn who's the boss in the closet. That's Craig. Die. Nice. Oh, hey there. We got the birthday boy. Come right on in. It's the least I could do for the birthday boy. Anything good on you though? Nope. This is now my Zen place. This is where I feel safe. This is where I will live out the rest of my day in just a daze. Not distinguishing reality from fiction. Ah! Okay, I did not see you, lady. Holy crap, you scared me. I heard a, I heard a zombie, but I thought it was her that's coming at me right now, not anyone else. Uh, die, please. Are we exhausted? We're good. Let's let her in and let's show her the cheese. Falcon, kick. Okay, there's one in here. Let's hurry up. Oh my God, there are so many. We're good in here still? Uh. Back towards the window. We, we we got this. I saw an axe in that zombie. And that would be a game changer for me. I need it. I need this. I need this to live. I need to make spears. Come on. Oh, this is not good. Okay. No, no, you're supposed to stay down. You, you can't get up either, sir. God damn. Okay, we gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. Ooh, mama, it's getting dangerous. It's a risky game. We play it. All right. We're going to sit down in the corner here and we're going to have to use our um our powerful, our, our power play. We're going to make a cockroach smoothie. AKA, we're going to eat this cockroach whole and then we're going to down it with an entire tea bag worth of caffeine. We're just going to eat the whole thing raw, just like the cockroach. Okay. Now we just wait like 20 minutes and we should be golden. Okay. I think we're ready. Let's do it. Spears out. If we get that axe, that's going to be a game changer for us. We'll be able to do so much more. The only problem is getting it. Thankfully, it's just him coming after us right now. 
Should be no problem for us. There we go. There's another one down. We might need to use our secret technique passed down from generation to generation. And that's to eat the entirety of the coffee grounds and um, climb a fence or something. I don't know. I didn't really think this far. Oh, God, we're already exhausted. That's A-OK. -okay. Bada, bam, are you not entertained? All right, that's four down. I don't know how many more there are, but that's a pretty good chunk taken out if I do say so myself. And up comes the second visitor. Slain. Um, they just keep on coming and they don't stop coming. Oh, would you please stop coming? My feet can only take so much abuse. <laughs> My bones can't handle this. Now I do see that we have a dirty bandage, but I'm so scared that we're going to lose a little bit of health taking it off that we'll just die horribly. So I'm going to leave that on. A little bit of tetanus never hurt anyone anyways. Am I right or am I right, everyone? Okay, we got two spears. Uh, I think, oh, oh, that's a lot more than I bargained for. Go, 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 go. Take her out. Tactical retreat. Like we got to get out of here. Oh, no, there's even more down there. This is not good. This is not good. This is not good. Please, please die. There we go. There's another one down. Okay, okay, okay. We're gonna have to. We're gonna have to. We're gonna have to follow the um the house right now. Move, 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 move. Come on. Okay, there we go. She's down. Watch behind us. Oh, this is so bad. Ugh. Okay, there's one down. <sighs> Fuck. Move, move, move. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> My body is so stressed. We're fine. Let's see if we can make it to Courtman Medical now. Charge faster, Craig! They're gaining on me! They're using pincer maneuvers! Push you over? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, it broke. It broke. -y. Oh my god. Oh, I'm dead. I am 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 dead. There's physically no way I can do this. This is so fucked right now. Oh! Oh! Ooh! My, my ass is so so clenched right now. Push you over. Go, go, go. Climb the fence. Hug the wall. <laughs> I don't like this game, man. <laughs> Please. Ugh. All right, all right, we can use the fence here. We just have to lose line of sight of most of them, and then we should be uh, cooking just a little bit more. Uh, we got another building here. We'll be all right. Everything will be okay. <laughs> My heart can't take this. How am I alive? I was... I, 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 I am not even... Uh, we have gained nothing today, but we're alive, and I can... Ah, <laughs> oh, you've got to be shitting me. This is a fucked up game we play today. There's one. There's two. Spear broke. That was my only weapon. I need to go back inside. I need to go back inside. Sh shit. Climb. We're in. There's another on the other side. Door flash. Okay, there's two. We can push. We can push. No! God damn it, Craig! Meet Kevin. Kevin still has it pretty freaking terribly. Matter of fact, he's losing health at an alarming rate. And the only reason why I say that he's doing a little bit better is because we're strong this time around. Yeah, that'll help me survive the apocalypse. Anyways, we're in like a new universe where Kevin here is going to survive. Probably, not probably. Anyways, we're, it's basically like the same old, same old here. We just, we're gonna grab some painkillers for Damn sure. And of course, <laughs> we're taking these. Anyways, I was not expecting to get that alarm, but you know, that's how the cookie uh, crumbles. And so my plan for today is to at least get a small little safe house, somewhere where we can chill out for a minute, cool it, and not die horribly. Of course, easier said than done. And now we can carry a whole 15 pounds instead of nine, which is pretty damn massive as well. Anyways, I think the main way we survive this type of series is if we use buildings to every single advantage and we clear every single building like it's a tactical game. No zombie in this neighborhood shall live. And then we can use a beautiful TV here to try and barricade a little bit better. Ooh, we got a rat. Yoink that. We also got ourselves a can opener and some uh, mustard. I won't be taking too much because we do need to have a, a little bit of extra weight going around here. And we got ourselves some gloves and some red silk boxers. And another thing, we need to use this time to our advantage. Right now, we're not tired, which means our strength is a little bit there. And so we're immediately going to head out into the 
into the depths. Ah! Yeah, I'm strong. Eat that, lady. All right, but actually, before we continue, I would like to grab something really quick. And it's this beautiful TV. Well, might as well start the barricade process as fast as possible, right? And we can we can afford the weight right now, so it's no biggie. Could you imagine picking up a 10 kilogram television with every just, with your your legs being ground to a fine dust? All right, that's a big horde up there. Oh, there's a lot of hordes here. Okay, maybe we head down to this neighborhood then. Yeah, yeah, that seems like a little bit better of a plan. Now, as long as we don't come across a horde like right behind this fence, we should be fine. Hey, look at that. This place is not so clear. Well, whatever. We can begin the um, barricade process by starting the television line here. It's going to be our only source of survival. We'll be avoiding that group down there. And we'll be making our way towards this beautiful home over here. So I hope you guys don't mind a visitor. I need a lot of good stuff. Okay, give me a kitchen knife, please. And an axe. And a saw would be pretty awesome. Just give me everything. And instead, all I get is a single water bottle. That's literally it in this place. Oh, beggars can't be choosers. And I will grab this pork chop. Chuck her in the oven. And turn that baby on for later. Oh. Back door is broken. That's... A little ominous. If if only we actually had a knife so we could turn that into a spear. But we don't. We're not as fortunate this time around. Hola, is anyone here? I've come to tell you about your car's extended, uh, warranty. Nope, 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 nope. Nothing in here. Wow, this place sucks. Though this would be a good base location for us. You know, it's a little little bit out there. It has a fence around it. Anyways, let's uh, let's go grab our pork chop, grab that television, and continue to try and get this place as fortified as possible. Oh my god, this pork chop is not being cooked. Whatever, it's fine. We'll shut the oven off. I don't want to burn this place down. And or trigger uh, the smoke alarms. All right, you're coming with me, bub. And we might as well go grab a table with it as well. Any little bits of uh, barricade help quite a bit, you know? And right now, we don't need to worry too much about the zombies. Oh, speaking of zombie, it's time for you to perish, sir. I'm going to be taking that tank top and those jeans off you as well. Thanks for the clothes, buddy. So let's hurry up and place the second television in our massive barricade to keep out the hordes. And also throw, throw a table right there as well. Yeah, that looks pretty good. All right, next home. We do have a... Uh, we're going to have to take those out. So let's see if we can do that in a timely manner. Hello, hello there, lady. Come right on over. Follow me into the hedges. Stupid idiot falls for it every time. <laughs> Boink. All right, we got two coming in after us right now. That's actually three. You know, I might be strong, but that doesn't mean I'm an idiot. Actually, that does mean I am a massive idiot. Bring it on! I will just outshove you in every respect of the manor. Oh, I broke your legs. Now I'm going to break your head. You think you can get up, lady? Hell no. Get back down. Boing. Oh, man, that was brutal. Give me that Spiffo shirt. I'd love to rep my favorite mascot and my favorite brand in Project Zomboid Spiffos. New Deluxe Burger, $2.99. All right, we got two more. Honestly, if I were to tell you a little secret, I'm just using this time that we're actually strong to feel like a small semblance of power before they get sapped away from me. And I have to rely on like coffee to power up my moves. So, you know, just, just, just let me live a little, man. Hurrah! Bop! God, I I love being strong. I love being capable. It's literally the it's it's the best. You know what? I know the baseball cap got us killed before, but I'm gonna take it another time. I, I'm feeling pretty confident. Though this time, instead of having it backward, which is a death flag apparently, we're gonna have it forward. There we go. Now we just look like a mechanic. You know what? I actually really don't like the cap. We're gonna drop it. Yeah, I like my hair being out and about. Ah! Oh, oh, fuck you. Fuck. Okay, there's three. There's three. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We're strong. We're capable. We can do this right now. Holy crap, dude. I, you can't be doing this to me. Uh, oh, I love being capable. But you know what I love more than being capable? Having an actual home that I can barricade and use well. I've given up, I've given up on the pipe dream of, uh, you know... 
of escaping this town and getting a working vehicle in this entire apocalypse. But I have not given up on just placing a bunch of random furniture in front of a gate and calling it safe. No, that's next level. I mean, if we could get this down before the end of today, I would feel so much better about my situation. And then we just have to deal with the other side. But I'm not going to think about that right now. Ba, ba, ba. Yes, the barricade grows. We're so close to securing this. We're actually going to go to the neighbor's house across from Courtman Medical to grab the other stuff here. Three zombies, no problem. The only reason why I say that is because we're, we're still strong. So it really is no problem killing these guys. Is that all you got, you punks? Oh, I... I, I love bullying zombies. This is what I really miss. And I think this is where we, uh, you know, failed in the other challenge. We didn't take advantage of uh, not being exhausted and on the brink of death. Ooh, I see a kitchen knife in there. Yo, ho, ho, let me in. Give me that right now. Oh, they were having a nice little, little bountiful feast here. Bountiful harvest. Yeah, give me that knife. I'm going to eat this pasta right now. It'll make me a tiny bit depressed, but, you know, it's worth it. Gravy, food, uh, plastic bag for carrying stuff. That's actually nice. And we also got some soup here with some rice. Yo, hell yeah. Honestly, being well fed is the only thing we have going for us right now. So I will be just indulging in the fine arts. Delicious and oh so nutritious. Alrighty, let's go grab the television and continue the uh, the efforts. And we'll might as well grab that TV or that table as well. And we're gonna skillfully go a, a side defense. Da, da. All right, we need how many more fences or how many more TVs? One, two, three. Three more televisions and we will have barricaded and secluded these rich neighborhoods. That's going to be great. It's going to be grand. Let's go ahead over to the next area then. Ooh, hold on. What do we have there? Oh, uh -huh. I dropped the rice right now. I, I need I need space for good stuff. Freaking survivor home this early. That's a... I don't, I don't know what kind of sign that is, but it's probably good. Hey, yo, is the front door unlocked? I don't have a lot of tools, so I can't really get in unless y'all start banging on that front door. <gasps> oh, that's a- Oh my god, that's a big cord. That's a big cord. That's a big cord. All right. Uh, we're fine. We're fine. We're strong. We're capable. This is what separates us from them. Hop the fence before he takes a chunk out of my goddamn spleen. Mm, mm, we're good. We're good. We're golden. We're fine. Just keep on shoving them back. Oh, I love being strong. Shut the door. Wait, take him out from the back. There we go. There's one. Okay, okay. My, my kicks are just not registering. Okay. Uh, bedroom has a window in the back. We can shut that. Open this. Turn around the side. Y'all have really underestimated me is all I will say today. Oh, how does it feel to get out smarted, bamboozled by Kevin? <laughs> Kevin the Destroyer to you. Yeah, I'm gonna break your legs. I'm gonna break all your legs, just like you did to mine. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, die, thank you. All right, that's how it's freaking done. Let's go grab the goddamn TV now. Kevin the Destroyer hobbles to his next victim. You know, that actually makes me wish there was a way to uh, change your nickname midway through. I feel like we've definitely earned the Destroyer moniker. Oh, that's a big horde up there. Well, we're only here for the television, so, you know, no problem for me. Though, if there is a zombie in here, I would love for you to start to break down these windows. Oh, hey! Woo. Watch where you're looking. You too, lady. Come on. I'm just trying to get my goddamn groceries. It's just a grind. Alright, now we can skillfully walk into this uncharted territory. Nothing in here. Perfect. Door flash. Uh, we got vitamins. Yo, those are massive in this challenge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's medicate. Uh, we got a granola bar. Yeah, pancake mix. Hell yeah, fruit jam. Even better. Another kitchen knife. Awesome. Matter of fact, we should make a uh, spear right now. This is what's going to separate us from them. You got to understand. There we go. Ooh, I also realized we have scissors. Okay, this is actually perfect. I did install a mod that allows us to attach stuff to uh, spears with leather, leather bindings, which I think makes a little bit more sense than just not being able to do that, so. But wait. Ah, oh, uh, goodbye. Ooh, denim shirt. You can rip that into clothing. Could, do you mind? I'm trying to do stuff here. God, these zombies have no respect for the for your fellow man. Anyways, let's uh rip up this denim shirt real quick. And now, oh, we actually need leather strips. Okay, we can't use denim. Dang it. Ah, okay. 
Yo, hold on. I'm gonna wear this shell, this shell suit stuff right here. If I'm gonna die this time, I'm gonna die in style. Oh, yeah, we're killing it. Oh, look at that neon look. Beautiful. All right, let's go grab the TV and let's get the heck out of here. Yoink. Ah, there we go. Okay, we're not exactly there yet, but we almost have something that kind of resembles a barricade. For now, we're gonna make it back to uh, one of these homes and we're just gonna take a little chill pill. Ooh, hold on. I forgot this lady had a leather jacket. Let's wrap that up real quick. And let's make a weapon to surpass Metal Gear. There's a reason why I brought that scalpel along. There we go, now that's a weapon. That's a real weapon. Anyways, we've done enough for today. So I think I'm gonna end the episode here and we're gonna drop off our beautiful bag. You know, I'm feeling pretty confident about Kevin. Just so long as he doesn't uh, trigger an alarm, we should be a-okay. Uh, trigger an alarm. Anyways, if you guys have liked this challenge so far, be sure to like, favorite, share, subscribe for more, and I might include some beautiful pancakes later. Peace out.